Donald Trump is the best. Anyway, hey guys, Narwhal Gaming here, and I know I haven't been on YouTube for a while, it's because, you know, fucking school is a pain in my ass. But you know, your boy Narwhal doesn't really give a fuck what they say, so he's on here anyway. But today I'm with Owie, of course. He's the best. He's the OG. I'm just kidding, you fucking suck. But today, but today we're gonna tell a story. It was, it's so, this story was kind of a weird story in the sense that this guy offered me, my boss, and him, uh, my other friend some weed. But, you know, like, we got up about, it was helping my boss move, but we got up about, I think, 8 o'clock maybe, no, it was about 6, 7 and we went to the Taekwondo school that I work at because we had to watch this karate testing and all that. My my boss wanted to, you know, help him with it, even though we do Taekwondo instead, which is better. But after that, like, I think, after that, I think everybody, both of the people that were testing were passed, I'm pretty sure. We go and I help, we help him move and we had a few laughs and all that. I almost dropped the couch down the steps because we had to climb up steps. To the apartment, and it was pretty funny to watch me carry that biggest shit by myself, because you know, I'm really scrawny as hell. But, my friend comes around to help us, and my boss is like, yo guys, you want to go check out the gym and all that? And I'm like, yeah, fuck yes, let's do this, because you know, I need to get my game on, show my, oh, oh, our muscles. Owie, shut the fuck up. And But anyway, back to the story that we get to the gym and we try the keys, and but my boss just literally moved in, so the keys did not work. So we had to go. We ended up going to the five different places, the offices, the apartment offices. And uh, at each one, I would steal like this handful of candy and all that type of shit. So my boss just looked at me like, what are you, like a fucking five-year-old? And I'm like, yes, that's exactly what I said. I'm like, yes, I am. But we get to this, the final one, I think it was like the fifth one. We get to it and shit. And it ends up like it being part of a bar and all type that type of fucking shit. So... What happened was, like, we got there, and he gave us a new key to the, the uh, gym and all that. He activated it. But, you know, we come back out, and there's these guys standing there. And it was like a Nebraska game. But it was something weird. Like, I'm pretty sure they were drunk, and they were just fucking with us. But they asked me and my boss and my friend that we wanted to smoke and all that shit. And they made, like, the joint, like, the roll weed type of gesture for it. And I look at my boss, and he looks at me, and I'm like, yeah, I would smoke if I was old enough. And my boss was like, no, you fucking retard. He meant, like, smoke some weed and all that. After that, like, I, I'm like, oh, and he, like, threw me in the car and talked to those guys, like, yelling at him, saying, like, no, you guys shouldn't be offering fucking kids this and all that shit, blah, blah, blah. After he scolded him for, like, a fucking hour, he, um, uh, comes back, and we go to the gym, and we're just sitting there all of the way silent. Nothing going on. Like, it was awkward as fuck. And we get out of the car. And I just look over at my boss's car. And shit. And, uh... I just see this big... Bird shit on his car. And I'm like, bro. You got some bird shit on your car. And I don't know what got my friend. He, like... It looked like he was smoking weed and all that shit. But... Um, uh, he just started laughing repeatedly, and it was really funny. Hostile UAV above. And, uh, so I, we sat there for about five minutes just staring at him, and he was, like, just laughing. And my boss is like, what's so funny? He's like, man, this dude says you got the bird shit on your car. And my boss just starts laughing historically, too. And I'm just staring at them like, you guys are fucking crazy. Why am I even with you guys? Yes. 
Yes. Don't fucking do my video, bitch. But anyway, I, I don't get why they're laughing and all that shit. So I'm like really confused and shit. But we go to the gym anyway. Like after that situation, we go to the gym. And uh, we get in there and, and there was like nobody in there. And my boss looks at me. He's like, you know what that means? I'm like, what? It means we can rape one of you guys. And I'm like, what the fuck? I'm like, I'm working for you and you just say this to me now. I don't feel safe and all that shit. And uh, what ended up happening is like, we just walked around for a little bit after that little joke right there. And we go back to the office to thank the guy for a, a, for a, uh, activating the car card. And those guys were there again. It was just so funny because they looked at us and my boss looked at them. And I looked back at my boss and he looked at me. It was like that Family Guy episode where they just nod at each other. It's like the Star Wars episode. Where they go, it's that really serious move, music, but you just nod at them and it goes back and forth. And uh, what ended up, the guys look at us and he goes, they come over to us, they're like, surround us. And they're like, do you want, to? then now they're, they ask this again, except with a more serious voice. And they're like, do you want to smoke? And I'm like, fuck no. So what happened was we got, we actually got them kicked out of the apartment. Because um uh, they were offering kids weed and all that. So my boss my, the people at the hotel um, uh, not the hotel, fuck. They asked the, the blah, 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 blah. I can't talk today, bro. It's been a long day. But no. They asked the guys to leave and all that. But, and we just start laughing, and the, the guy that activated our car, she's like, what the fuck are you laughing? And all that shit. And we're like, it was just a joke. And all that. It, but he's like, I didn't, it wasn't funny to me. He's like, I don't want any type of smoking or weed in my office or shit like that. And I'm like, bro, just calm your shits and all that. So anyway, like, yeah, just calm your shit, bro. I mean, have you ever had one of those days where you just want to calm your shit? Yeah. Yeah, you have. But anyway, like, like, we go back and we tell his girlfriend and all that, and she starts laughing. She's like, yeah, because, like, she didn't, she thought it was funny because she, the guy already called her and told her what happened because she thought, like, that they were like my parents or something. And shit. But it was just really funny because after all that, it, it was just an overreaction of the guy that owned the apartments. So you kids know now not to ask, take from a overreact when people ask you for weed. You guys should just accept it and then sell that shit on your own. Yeah, just smoke it, bro. I'm kidding. I do not legalize the thing of drugs and all that shit. That's true. That's true. But just don't do drugs, kids. That's yeah, unless if it's recreational, like how we said. But I hope you guys enjoyed story time with me. I mean, if you guys did, please leave a like and a subscribe. And yeah, I'll see you guys later. Bye.